Love each other. Who? Sharina and the man. My mother's name is Sharina. Yes, I know. I'm not surprised. Most people do. The Tamerlane family is well known in Barbados. Indeed, yes. Almost anyone could have told you Sharina Tamerlane is my mother. Yeah, I believe that. I've learned a lot about Victoria Sugar since I've been in Barbados. And why are you so interested in Victoria Sugar? You're not Bayesian. You have no ties with us. No, ma'am, I don't. But you have ties with the States. You are mistaken. I don't think I am. What about Victoria Sugar's ties with Spalding Enterprises? I know of no such ties or connections. You run the company, don't you? I am president and managing director of Victoria Sugar, yes. Then you should be well aware that Victoria Sugar at one time was a subsidiary of Spalding Enterprises. No, Mr. Reardon, you are mistaken. My family owns Victoria Sugar, no one else. No, ma'am, your family owns it now. Forty years ago, it was a subsidiary of Spalding. I've never heard of this Spalding company. I have a computer printout that has names, dates, even the check numbers of all the transactions that took place. This isn't possible. Victoria Sugar was built by my mother and father. It is not now, nor has it ever been, a subsidiary of another company. Okay, uh, fine. Let's forget about Victoria Sugar and Spalding Enterprises. Miss Tamerlane, did your mother and, and, and father and you ever live in the United States? No, never. Perhaps Miss Tamerlane is correct. 
Perhaps another family. No, I... No, it's possible that if you were very young, you, you didn't even know it was the United States, but, but you might remember a house, okay? Think, the, a very small cottage. It's near a river. Uh, it has a, a huge garden out front. It's too big for the house. And uh, from the front door, straight across the living room, there's a fireplace. Um, upstairs in the bedroom. The roof slants down to one side so that it comes to a point where a child could reach up and touch the roof. Mr. Reardon, that cottage obviously means a great deal to you. It means nothing to me. I have never been there. But you're Sharina's daughter. Obviously another family. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some business to attend to. Good day, Officer Foster. Mr. Reardon, is your father alive? Good day, Mr. Reardon. He isn't, is he? He died when you were very young, am Mr. I right? Mr. Reardon, I am asking you to leave. Mr. Tamerlane, Reardon, would you go. please listen to me? The skeleton of a black man was found in a tunnel underneath that cottage. The body had been there for 40 years, and I'm willing to bet that was Sharina's husband, which makes it your father. Miss Tamerlane, he was murdered. Well, you're in excellent physical condition. I don't foresee any problems. Good, then can we do it now, today? Oh, no, I... No, I think so. I, I have to make arrangements. Well, there is some sort of urgency to this, isn't there? I mean, what kind of arrangements? Well, you'll have to stay in the hospital overnight. For one thing, you need a D&E. Why? Because you're in your second trimester. Second trimester? Yes, to be exact, you're three and a half months pregnant. Oh, no, there's got to be some kind of mistake. Oh, oh there's no mistake. Oh, within a week, these tests are extremely accurate. I mean, that's why we do the sonogram, in case there's a question. I can't be that far along. Well, yes, but you are. I'd say conception took place, yes, towards the end of July. Oh, excuse me. Yes? Oh. Ra yes, all right. All right, I'll, I'll be there right away, Dr. Darnell. Look, I'm sorry. This is something I just have to take care of. I'll only be a few minutes, okay? Yes. I'll be back as soon as I can. End of July. And why haven't you insisted on your rights as a husband? You don't insist on something like that. It has to be freely given. Hold me, old man. Just... Hold me. Harlan. Oh, Harlan. It's your baby. 